Emma Watson has cast a spell on her rumored new beau. The Harry Potter star has stunned her friends and fans with a new budding romance. She was recently seen with a mystery man taking a stroll around Venice, holding hands and cozying up with each other. You can say things are getting pretty serious. Who is the mystery man? And where did Emma meet him? Keep watching today's video as we spill the beans. Starting off with Emma's self-partnership. Fans wondered whether Emma Watson would ever find romantic love in her life after she announced to the world in 2017 that she was self-partnered. Many alleged that the Harry Potter actor could be asexual or bisexual. There was a whole rumor mill at work, but that never budged the Beauty and the Beast star. The actor has repeatedly stated that she loves being single to dispel the stigma and negative connotations associated with single women in their late 20s and early 30s. She's been super vocal about wanting to remain by herself unless she finds someone special. And we saw her dating that someone special between 2019 and 2021. The star had found herself in a committed relationship with businessman Leo Robinson. Despite her outlook on love and self-partnership, this young man had managed to win her heart. In fact, the two were oh so adorable together and so much in love that engagement rumors began circulating pretty soon into the relationship. But that, unfortunately, didn't work out, and the two called it quits before things got serious. From that point on, it was unclear whether Emma would be prepared to open her heart once more, but it appears that she has in recent months. The popular actress and the son of a controversial businessman, Brandon Green, have been seen together on a few occasions. This has led to rumors that the star is yet again heading for the serious relationship territory. Let's look at who Emma's new beau is. Brandon Green Green was born in Monaco and attended the international school there before joining his father's business, Digital Transformation and Technology, as an executive director in 2014. He also appeared on Tatler's list of the top 10 single billionaires the same year. According to Forbes, his parents, Philip Green and Christina Green, are estimated to have a net worth of $2.1 billion through their Arcadia Group. Philip owns well-known British clothing retailers like Topshop, Topman, Dorothy Perkins, Miss Selfridge, and many more. What many probably don't know is that Brandon's sister, Chloe, made headlines when she began dating model Jeremy Meeks, also known as the Hot Felon. Yep, it's the same dude whose mugshot went viral in 2014. The couple announced their engagement in 2017, welcomed their son Jaden in 2018, and then confirmed their breakup in 2019. Honestly, this entire family is quite controversial. Brandon Green's father, Philip Green, allegedly engaged in inappropriate behavior, including racial, physical, and sexual abuse of those who worked for his business empire. According to Daily Telegraph, some of the people involved had complained about Green's behavior, but those complaints had been ignored or covered up. He's accused of paying people a lot of money in some instances in exchange for their silence. The business tycoon has also been accused of making racist remarks to black employees, groping female staff members, and acting violently toward both male and female staff members. Okay, these are some pretty serious allegations. And while we're totally shipping Emma and Brandon as a couple, we're not sure about the guy's family as concerned fans. But that's just us. Moving on to the new lovebirds in town, Emma and Brandon. The rumored couple was first seen together after getting off a helicopter in London's Battersea neighborhood. They were then spotted holding hands in Venice. Emma was seen wearing a cap-sleeved red and white dress and a pair of black sandals looking like the absolute dream that she is. There aren't many details about how the duo actually met, but some speculate that it might have something to do with their shared passion for environmental work. According to a source, Brandon shares the same interests as Emma, and he's a longtime outspoken environmental activist. Apparently, Brandon has been super interested in biodiversity and saving the oceans as of late. Besides that, he makes a significant contribution to the philanthropic causes of both Princess Charlene and Prince Albert of Monaco. He's also often seen participating in charity events and galas for the environment. Brandon does frequent beach cleanups and has been doing whatever he can to help the planet in his own capacity. We can totally see why he's gotten Emma's attention. The dude's a gentleman and checks most of the boxes we assume she's had in mind. Now, for Brandon's problematic family. Brandon may be perfect for Emma, but many have raised concerns about his family. Fans are unsure if the Harry Potter star will like his family's pastimes, which include a lot of environmental pollution and unethical business practices, alleged by several people time and again. This also includes frequent trips on super yachts and private planes, the two major environmental polluters that are being used unsparingly by billionaires. The Greens are often seen taking short trips on their jets and yachts. And given that the actress is well known for wearing ethically produced, sustainable designer outfits during red carpet appearances, while her new beau's family has basically amassed wealth by taking advantage of the fast fashion industry with questionable practices. It's very likely that their morals and values would clash somewhere. But it appears that Brandon personally doesn't share his father's love of fast fashion based on remarks made by close sources. For now, the two are clearly in love. It's the honeymoon 
second phase of their relationship. And we all know what that means. Everything is beautiful during this phase. It's usually the time when people would happily compromise their values and morals. And honestly, we won't be surprised if Emma decides to put hers on hold for a while as well. But she's generally not known to have a lot of flings or relationships just for the heck of it. Very few people have been able to call the star their girlfriend. And Brandon happens to be among the lucky few. And she clearly has a good reason for that. The gentleman has swept her off her feet. But it's too early to say whether this relationship will have any legs. Has Emma finally found the Prince Charming of her dreams? Or is he going to be yet another heartbreak? Only time shall tell. Let's have a look at some other related news now. First, Leonardo and Gigi are cozying up. Looks like Leonardo DiCaprio is finally broadening the age ranges of the women he dates. The popular 27-year-old model, Gigi Hadid, is the newest beauty the perpetual playboy reportedly has his sights set on as his next potential date. Multiple sources have confirmed to people on Monday that the 47-year-old actor and supermodel have been spending time getting to know each other in New York City. Although an insider told the publication that the two are not dating yet, a different source asserted that the Wolf of Wall Street actor is definitely pursuing the single mother of one. But other sources have confirmed that the blonde beauty isn't interested in a relationship with Leonardo right now, and the two are just pretty good friends. Whatever it is, we're glad that the Don't Look Up star has finally been seen with a woman above 25. Next up, Sabrina Carpenter and Dylan O'Brien spark dating rumors. After the NYC reveal, it's safe to say that all eyes are on the actors, sparking fan reaction and speculation on social media. According to Pop Crave, Sabrina Carpenter and Dylan O'Brien were allegedly seen together in New York City. The picture appears to show Dylan holding a phone in his hand and looking back at the camera, and we can see what appears to be Brina's head, although it's distorted. Thanks to the trending photo, dating rumors started to circulate online, and many fans have been wondering if the actors are dating. The rumors generated a lot of online buzz, and a ton of TikTok videos where users started shipping Sabrina and Dylan together. But it's important to note that there hasn't been any official confirmation that the two are actually dating. Finally, Britney Spears' Road to Royalty. Looks like Britney almost made it to Buckingham Palace once. An exchange between the star and the now Prince of Wales via email from their teenage years has surfaced, confirming the two had been seeing each other. The singer revealed she had invited the then Duke of Cambridge out to dinner while she was out on tour in the UK in a throwback interview with talk show host and comedian Frank Skinner. In a recently surfaced interview, the singer explained that a budding romance between the heir to the throne and the princess of pop didn't work out. She said she was blown out by the prince. He apparently preferred going fox hunting over a night out with the star. Ouch, that must have hurt. Buckingham Palace has consistently refuted rumors of their online romance. But in September of last year, royal biographer Christopher Anderson revealed even more information about Britney and William's alleged online relationship. Britney didn't let the rejection keep her down and went on to date Justin Timberlake soon after. And that's a wrap for this video. Do you think the budding romance between Emma and Brandon will last? Comment below and let us know. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more. See you in the next one.